Fubara to decide LG chairmanship amidst tension over tenure extension. Today being June 17 seemed to be a very normal day like every other day, but absolutely not the same case with River State as it weighs so much significance. You're welcome to Niger Anchor News. I am Abigail. Today marks the end of the three-year term for the elected local government chairman, as outlined by the state's local government law. This day has highlighted the growing political conflict between Governor Siminalai Fubara and his predecessor, Yesom Wiki, now the Minister of the Federal Capital Territory. The tension escalated significantly after a fire in the State House of Assembly on October 30, 2023, which caused a major rift within the Assembly. Speaker Martin Amewule gained the support of 27 members while four members sided with Edison Ehi the former deputy speaker who was later replaced by Victor Okojombo. In the midst of this crisis, Amewule's assembly passed an amendment to extend the tenure of elected chairmen and councillors by six months if elections were not held. This amendment was overturned by a high court ruling which followed a lawsuit from the council chairman of Opobo Nkoro and Boni, Pro wicket chairmen faced additional challenges when the state high court restrained Amewule's group from legislative activities, and this was upheld by an appeal court ruling. Despite the legal setbacks, Amewule and his colleagues expressed their defiance against accepting caretaker committee members, while Governor Fubara reminded the council chairmen of their impending exit from office. Political analysts are now waiting for Fubara's decision on the leadership of the 23 local government areas. So, let's take a few comments before we round up. And this first comment from Niger Observer, it reads, Governor Fubara has a tough decision to make. Extending the tenure or appointing new chairmen will definitely stir the political pot even more. And this one coming from Fubara fan, he said, Governor Fubara is right. Those chairmen have had their time. Let's get some fresh faces in there to make real changes. And coming from Echo Voice, another day, another political feud. When will our leaders put the people's needs first? Legal Igu said the High Court's decision should be respected. Extending the tenure without elections is not democratic. And lastly, from Rivers Resident, can we just have a smooth transition for once? This constant fighting is embarrassing for the state. Thank you for staying through to the end with us. We hope to have your comments in the comment section. And don't forget to keep watching Niger Anchor News for more news updates.